Well, now at four, a tree lands on top of a building. Now more than 100 men and women have no place to go. So this is a little bit of what it looked like yesterday, but this is a nursing home in Clewiston. And during a storm last night, the roof popped right off of the building. Wink News reporter Amy Gallo joins us live now in Clewiston. Amy, what's the latest out there? Well, people out here are feeling fortunate, lucky, like they know things could have been so much worse. Thankfully, all 117 people who call this nursing home home made it out safely. If you walk down Ventura Avenue, it's impossible to miss the debris. Trash blowing, garbage cans flying, trees breaking. It's like it was something I've never seen before and it's very scary. People here in Clewiston believe a tornado whipped through here late Wednesday afternoon. Like it came out of nowhere. Whether it was a tornado or just strong winds, they knocked down trees and took out transformers. A big, like some, like a big bomb. Boom! And from the Wink News drone, the severe weather lifted the roof right off the nursing home. That's where Sherlin's godmother lives. She's a resident at where the tree is broken. That's her room there at the nursing home. Despite how it looks, Pass's grandmother and every one of the other 116 people who call the nursing home home got out safely. Nurses I spoke to say they noticed the winds picking up and quickly got everyone out of their rooms. Eventually, first responders evacuated everyone to a nearby auditorium, and now they're at a sister nursing home in Lakeland. Meanwhile, contractors are already working to repair the roof and any other damage they find. Safety is our number one priority. Uh, the nursing home will have to go through many inspections um, with the state and with the county. New at 5, I'll explain how quick response by first responders and the roofers may have not just saved a lot of lives, but saved the life of the building itself. Live in Clewiston, Amy Gallo, Wink News.